we're gonna do this, this, and then a big brain or big damage AoE. Let's see it here. Come on, Demon Meliodas, clutch up for me, bro. Okay, 136k AoE, level 3 AoE here, let's see. Let's go! Okay, so we did it! What's going on, guys? Your boy Amazing, we're back with another video, and in today's video, guys, we're gonna be doing a PvP showcase on the boy Green Demon Meliodas. So this is the team we're going to be using here for your boy Green Demon Meliodas here. Is he better than Assault Mode Meliodas? We're going to test it out in this video. So Green Demon Meliodas, I'm running him with attack crit damage. Um, his crit damage like like percentage isn't really high. Like You would think it would be higher on a Demon Meliodas. But he actually has really low crit damage, which is kind of crazy. But yeah, I mean, we're running attack crit damage anyway, trying to boost his damage as much as possible. I'm running Death Pierce backline. Um, he's attack crit, you are gear. Um, yeah, like all the rolls maxed out basically. It's a Meliodas, like my Meliodas gear is really good. Um, so yeah, he's just, you know, 48k CC, 2 out of 6. Uh, we're gonna see how well he can do, man. We're gonna see how well he can do. Um, especially with all the one Eskimos running around, I thought we'd bring like a green unit into the PvP here. Um, we wanted to be able to, like, try and stop that unit, but, but we're, we're gonna try and see how well it goes. I'm running attack food as well because we get to about 17k attack with him, so we're gonna be doing a lot of damage. And uh, yeah, we're about 239k CC. Um, let's hop into the first match and see how well we do. Alright, so we're hopping into the first match of the video here. We got a Goddess Elizabeth Glue Eater with the one Essenor. We're going to go first, which is good. Um, you do get a merge as well. And we get a, another rank up as well too. So I think what I'm going to do, turn one, is actually just rank up Melee. Um, go for this. And then I guess we'll just... Uh, Ah, but will Infect be an... I, I, no, we might as well Infect. We might as well. Turn one. We might as well. Hopefully, it's not Evade Food. Okay, good. Okay. Okay, Melly. I see you. Are we going to break Revive turn one? Let's see. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay, Demon Meliodas. Okay, Demon Meliodas. Okay, and we got another single target card as well. Um, Let's just see here. He's going to reset. It looks like this is a bot. But still, man, we <laughs> What? That was turn one, and we had a level two with that uh, AoE card, so that was pretty good. He's gonna dissolve. Let's just see here, go for the single target onto Elizabeth. That's fine, man. Because Demon Meliodas, he really is, is putting in the work here. We'll just shield up. We'll drop that card next turn, and we're about to do a ton of damage there. Okay, there we are. Apply Dissolve. We shield up. We're gonna lose gauge, which is perfectly fine. Then we get another merged right there. Okay, it's looking like a lot. We did already break revive, which is good. Um, I don't know how much car damage that card's gonna do without a crit, but we'll have to see. Okay, he's gonna go for my goddess Elizabeth there. So I gotta kill as the one Esnor now before he starts healing up. So I'm gonna do this card. Actually, no, we'll do this card first, and then I'll do this, and then. I guess we'll attack into Gossilus, but that should kill, like, even without crits. Yeah, easy clap. So, 89k, single target, no crits. I'm gonna do the dissolve right there. And then single target into Gossilus, but here. There we go, seal her. And he has Lost Vein backline, and then what we can do from now is since we've sealed the Goss Elizabeth, we can ult the Goss Elizabeth, get 3 gauge, and then we can just start gaining our gauge back, yo. So that's going to be pretty nice. Let's just see. So he's going to merge and rush go through ultimate. Okay. But he is dissolved. So that's going to be a little bit annoying for him. He's going to get a single target onto my Green Doom Meliodas. That's going to do a lot of damage. Okay. Calm down. Alright. So we're going to alt the... Oh wait. We got to apply dissolve first. We got to do that, that, and then we'll do that. There we go. We apply the dissolve. We drop the ultimate with Green Demon Meliodas. Bop. We do 669k um, damage. We full heal. We got like 139k life steal right there. Okay, you love to see it, man. You really love to see it. Okay, so Green Demon Meliodas is like full health right now. And then now we just stun the Green Demon or the Lost Vein Meliodas at the end here. And uh, it's a wrap. Like, it's a wrap at this point. Like, there's not really much you can do. Let's just stun his ass. And it should be a wrap. Let's just, uh... Pop. That's a lot of crits from Goss Elizabeth there, too. 
There we go, easy clap. Alright, so we're hopping into the next match of the video here. We got a Sariel Droll Comp. Gonna be 251k CC there. Let's see. You get a merge with Demon Meliodas. Um, I think if he wants to go for the kill with his Sariel, I don't think his Sariel will be able to one bang my, my Demon Meliodas with Revive. So let's just see here. He's gonna apply Dissolve. I think he's gonna put a Taunt up actually too, yeah. So he is. Level 2 Taunt. Um, that's fine, that's fine right there. I think he can just kind of test out damage here with Demon Meliodas, so I think I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna rank up Demon Meliodas. We're gonna shield up, and then I'm just gonna dissolve. And then the turn after, we're just gonna, you know, pop off on his uh, droll there. Let's see. We just don't want him to start getting his ultimate going with droll, because the droll's ultimate can pop off uh, with the taunt up, so we'll have to worry about that a little bit. Uh, we don't get a rank up, but we do technically have a level 3 of both cards. So, we'll have to see. We'll have to see what, I'm, what I plan on doing here. I think I'm going to go with the single target though, and then just AoE. He's going to go for the Petrify on Liz, and it doesn't break the shield. That's really good for us. And he's going to go for the Petrify on Demon Meliodas. He's not going to break the shield again. So that that's just unfortunate on, on his part there. But um, I'm just going to do this card right here. We're going to do Dissolve. I'm going to do this Dissolve. And I'm going to do the Infect so they can't lifesteal. So let's just do that. Let's see how much this does. Okay, so we're critting Droll there. That's a good amount of damage. 179k from Demon Meliodas. We get the kill there. Okay. Okay, you love to see it. We get the Infect card. Let's see. We do about 77k. Okay, you love to see it. Okay, Demon Meliodas. Okay, that's some pretty good damage there. Goddess Elizabeth's gonna come out. That's gonna cuck his Sariel. Um, Green Gulther thing he had going there. Um, let's just see, man. Demon Meliodas is shocking me there. He, he's doing a lot. Okay, let's see. So he's gonna single target into Demon Meliodas. He's not gonna get the kill. He's gonna single target again into Demon Meliodas. Okay, that's a little bit. I'm gonna try and go for the kill on his uh, Sariel, actually. I think I might be able to do it. It's gonna be super close, though. Actually, nah, we play it safe. We play it safe. We shield up. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna play it safe. I'm gonna play it safe. We rank up Goss a little bit, shield up, and uh, stun the uh, Sariel there. That's definitely the safest play. Like, I was gonna go for the damage, but I don't know if I trust the Ameliotis yet. So, we'll just do that. He had two cards as well, still. So, that was kind of scary. If he used three cards on me, he probably could have killed me there. But I think from here it's a wrap because now he's scared and forced in to attack into my uh, green guilt there. He does have revive still, so that's another thing to note. But I think I might, I should be able to kill him actually. Let's see, I think he might just go for the stun here. Does he go for the stun? He's gonna go for the level 3 stun, okay. So, we're just gonna have to... Damn, that's a, <sighs> that's so annoying. Okay, so I'm gonna do... Hmm, this is something else, yo. Okay, so I'm gonna do this card right here. Hope the AoE kills, and then hope the AoE kills again. That's literally all I can do here, so. Come on. Okay, Demon Meliodas is popping off. Okay, you love to see it. Okay, AoE. Okay, proc revive on the Sariel. Yo, you love to see it, bro. 153k, and look at it. Demon Meliodas, bro. Okay. Once he starts getting them go through stacks, he starts popping off. You love to see it. All right. So we're hopping into the next match of the video. Here we got a Sariel, the one Eskinor team. We are going to go first. So it, lo it looks like it's going to be evade food, I think, um, from the CC that they had. We'll play it safe. We'll do the rank up onto Demon Meliodas. So let's uh, rank him up. Okay. It's lagging. I, I, mean, I, I guess it's a real player because of the lag. All right. So we're going to rank up Demon Meliodas, shield up, and dissolve. That's definitely the play, just because um, if he has evade food, we can test the evade food with the dissolve, and then we also get the rank up onto Doom Meliodas. So it is evade food. Yes, right. Let's go. Okay, so... Now we just gotta kill his the one Escanor this turn, if we can. But we do get a rank up as well to do that, which is good. And then... Yeah, I mean, we can just pop off here. And we'll also make it so Sariel can't lifesteal his HP, so... Okay, so he's going to double rank up into Sariel, actually, so... I mean, at this point, low-key, I might go for the for the kill on his Sariel. How much how much does he have on his Sariel? Let's see. Um, 
And he does have Go Through Ultimate as well too. 184k HP? That's a lot. I'll, I don't know if my Demon Meliodas can do that. I don't think he can, man. Even with type advantage on a level 3. I don't know. I'm going to do this, this, and then... I'm going to shield up actually. Yeah, no. I'm going to I'm gonna do that because we're, what we're going to do here is seal the one Escanor. And we almost get the kill too. We seal the one Escanor. So he can't gain gauge. And then we'll shield up. And then what we'll do next turn is then we'll go for the kill um, on the Sariel. And the AoE should be able to kill the one Escanor if he doesn't attack here too. So let's just see. He's going to go for the level 3 here. Um, I guess. I don't know. He's going to go for that. Thinking he breaks the shield. Gonna go for the level 3 here. This is not gonna do any crits at all. Um, which is good for us. And he's gonna single target into Gilther there. So that's gonna do a lot of damage there. Um, yeah, nah, he, he, bro, that is kinda like, low-key bullshit, but, um, we'll have to give it to him here if we cannot get this kill. Um, I don't know if I kill against the Sariel though, man. Ah, uh, okay, we're gonna have to try it. We're gonna do this, this, and then a big brain or a big damage AoE. Let's see it here. Come on, Demon Meliodas, clutch up for me, bro. Okay, 136k AoE, level 3 AoE here, let's see. Let's go! Okay, so we did it! Yo, Demon Meliodas! Okay, you love to see it, bro. Okay, who's gonna come out from the back line here? We're gonna have Death Pierce, so he's still gonna have his stacks. Um, so this this could do a lot of damage here and could cuck us, but we'll have to see. Let's see how much this uh, Green Gilter does. Th this ultimate could do a lot, though. We gotta watch out. Um, it, this might just one bang me low key. Hopefully it doesn't though. Hopefully it doesn't. Um, let's see. Uh, is he gonna apply dissolve? How much is that gonna do? That does a lot of damage, man. Hopefully this doesn't just one shot me with King Link and uh, Max Stacks. Uh, I mean, there you go, man. That that okay. I'm gonna keep that match in the video because that was like an actually like a really close one. But this guy's Green Gelter, man. How many dupes did he add? How many dupes? Cause that oh my gosh, that did so much damage. What the hell? Let me see. Let me see the dupes. Four six with three. Okay. Oh, all right. Well, we'll give it to this guy. Um, that, that was a pretty good match though. Demon Meliodas did clutch up there at the end, but I mean, you know, Green Gelt and Alton is just too busted, bro. We'll give it to him. All right, so we are hopping into the next match of the video. Here we got like, the one Essener team. We're gonna be 232 KCC there. Um, let's just see. I'm gonna test to see if there's evade food, so I'm gonna do the dissolve card. So let's just rank up um, DML Yodis here. We'll do the dissolve card and then we'll do the shield. There we go. Easy clap, easy clap. Yo, let's just see. Real player, it looks like. Um, I can rank up into DML Yodis and do his AoE. And then, I can also do a single target onto Goss Elizabeth there, maybe so she doesn't get her ultimate. Um, but yeah, let's just see. Let's just see here. So he's going to kind of rush his Gilter ultimate there a little bit. Um, apply Dissolve as well. Dissolve's not going to break the shield. Yeah, so he was evade food, I guess, because the Dissolve didn't hit him. So that's good to know. Um, I'm gonna rank up into Demon Meliodas. I'm gonna do the AoE. And then... I think we'll just double AoE, actually. Okay, level 1 AoE should break it then. Let's do this. Or no, 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 no. Let's get go through ultimate, actually. What? Okay. Rank up Demon Meliodas. Do the Infect. Dissolve. What? What? Okay, let's do that. Yeah, I, lo I love this attack animation, man. Okay, 131k AoE, no crits. You know, apply dissolve there as well. There we go. So now they can't get, um, they can't get any ultimates on any of their units there. And we have Green Goat their ultimate. Um, we still have God's Elizabeth the revive as well. So this looks like a really good uh, scenario for us, depending on what they do. But if he has a stun, I might get cucked. But I mean, we do have a stun ourselves. But hopefully, he doesn't stun my Green Goat here. He's gonna go for his Essenor damage, okay. So he, I guess he trusts in his Essenor. Oh no, he has a level 2 rank up, okay. Okay, so he's gonna go for that. That's not gonna break the... That's not gonna, you know, proc revive there. He's gonna go for the stun. If this kills me, it'll... Okay, that's not gonna kill. Unfortunate, bro. Okay, so... 
Now what we gotta do is I gotta get a kill and then I gotta kill again. That's so. Ah, so I'm gonna do the infect again. I guess AOE. We're gonna do the single target onto Goss Elizabeth. Hopefully that kills, and then I guess we'll just stun Goss Elizabeth again. So let's see. Good amount of damage, 181k. And Team Meliodas is going to do 236k single target. And then we're going to get the stun on Goss Elizabeth there. So it's like decent, a decent amount of his hand is cleared out. Um, he's, he is going to get debuff immunity on his the one Escanor there. But I still have revive, so that's another thing to note. Um, he's kind of forced to go into my um, green filter there. But I'll, I'm hoping a lot of his cards are green filter. If they're not, I'm kind of cucked here. If a lot of those are the one SNR, I am cucked, bro. Let's see. Let's see here, bro. He's going to do a rank up, I assume. An attack with the one Escanor. So, let's see. Hopefully, he remembers that I have revive. Because he did not break that yet. So, he's going to do that. Is he going to attack into my melee? He's going to attack into Gilter. Okay, so that's fine. That's fine, that's fine. Okay, so that's going to merge with the Goss Elizabeth there. We have proc revive. He is going to be almost full health there too. Which is a little unfortunate for me. Um, but I'm just going to stun... I'm just going to stun his uh, green Delta there. Stun his goddess Elizabeth if that doesn't kill. And then just rush Demon Melly ult. I think that's the only play I got here. Let's just do that. We stun his green Delta. Stun his goddess Elizabeth. Hopefully this doesn't kill. Okay, nice. That's his whole hand. He only got one card with Escanor. This is really good for us, actually. This is really good. I can apply a debuff and actually just one-shot his Escanor. So I think we got this, yo. I think we got this in the bag. Low-key. Let's see it. Let's see it. Okay. I mean, his a okay, his Essener is a threat, but if his Gilter gets ultimate, I'm cucked. So, and we don't have green Gilter, um, you know, to help us uh, like at all. So you gotta just, you gotta just hope, man. Is the one Essener gonna be able to one bang like one of my units with one card? And depending on what it is. If it's an influx, I'm screwed. Okay, so he's not able to one bang. That that's really good. Okay. So he's gonna get ultimate there. Um, I'm gonna do this card right here. I'm gonna... Okay, yo, this is this is kind of crazy, bro. Who do I go for the kill? Because I can do... Ah... Uh, you gotta you gotta just go for the kill here, and then just... I think that? I don't know if that's the play, man. I don't, I don't know if that's gonna be enough. Okay, let's see. Okay, Demon Melly, how much are you going to do here? We're, we don't have a debuff on Goss Elizabeth, so... Okay, so it's going to do 100k. Oh, if this is enough, come on, Demon Meliodas. Oh, if I had Green Gother, he would have crit! Okay, if if he drops ultimate and doesn't kill me, then he's cucked. Like, he's actually cucked. Depending on who comes out from the back. Derriere? Okay. I don't, know, I don't know why he has Derriere in the back. Okay, hopefully this ultimate does not kill us, because we have, like, you know, 6-6 six, six Liz. If he doesn't kill with this ultimate here, he's going to get reflected and die instantly. So, ho hopefully, man. Let let's just see. Hopefully. And we also have that PvP rule as well, where if you don't kill with an ultimate, then uh, everyone basically gets, like, a ton of health. So, let's just see. He doesn't kill. Goodbye, full heal. Okay. And then he's going to buff with Derry. Okay. And then attack with the one. Okay, he's getting reflected there. That's going to do a lot. Okay. Okay, Demon Meliodas, bro. You need to clutch up for me, bro. Low key. I'm going to do this infect card. I'm going to merge Liz. And then just stun. Because he can't get ultimate right now. Or he can't, uh... What's it called? What's the word, man? He can't get debuff immunity because he's not at his turn 3 yet. So, let's just stun. Make it so he can't do anything there. And then if we can get a merge here... Okay, we have Goss Elizabeth Ultimate. We have the single target. I think the one Escanor dies here next turn, which is good. But depends how much this Derry does to us. Let's see. You know, buff up. Single target into Death Pierce. That's going to reflect and do a decent amount of damage there. Um, so now we're just going to go for the kill. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. And then we're just going to do whichever card does more with Death Pierce here. This card. Okay, hopefully, hopefully this works out. We got two Liz Ultimates off in this match, bro. What the hell? Okay. Come on, Demon Meliodas. 
Or he's just gonna do it. And we're gonna get the gauge. Okay. And then we're gonna, you know, do that shatter card right there. We have ultimate with Demon Meliodas. If he doesn't have a... If he doesn't have a what's it called with Derriere, a level 2 buff, then he's screwed, bro. Because I just apply a debuff and nuke him with Demon Meliodas. It's a wrap. Let's go! Demon Meliodas, man. Green Demon Meli, from, like, from the playtesting I did, a lot of the matches I kind of got cucked because of the one Essendor just being so busted, bro. But damn, this match went down to the wire, bro. If I did not play it out, I, I would have... Uh, oh, damn, bro. Okay, but we're definitely going to give it to this guy, bro. He, he did well. Um... But yeah, it's a wrap. Let's see how much Demon Meliodas does. 436k single target with no green Gelter stacks, just Death Pierce. Pretty good, man. Alright, so that's going to be it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe as always. And if you guys want to see more videos like this, definitely let me know in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.